Hi guys, it's Dylan here from Grand Geckos, and I just built this small rack, and I have two more I'm building tomorrow. It's kind of fucked up, I know, I know, but it serves its purpose. And I'm going to add one more section up top, and then have a hatchling rack, fill that area up, may possibly scoot it over that way, so it fills this whole wall up perfectly. And I just bought a baby hypo citrus bearded dragon. I'm putting in there. And I got my two originals over there. I got some wax worms. Uh, what else? Uh, nothing in that tank. I don't really know what I'm going to do in it. Um, there is the incubator. Oh. Uh, and those baby birds died. Yeah. I was feeding them and they just... Well, two of them didn't even hatch. They just cooked in the incubator, basically. And one I was taking care of and that box right there. Uh, that one died, sadly. Yeah, but here, let's look at this. albino female and I'm buying two eclipse males uh, next week fill this make some radar um, albino leopard gecko I don't need to put holes in these because they got these little vents right there, so they'll be good on there. Blue cystic. In shed. Hypo, high yellow, these beautiful colors. And all that carrying around those two. And this pretty cool little gecko. Yeah, there's nothing much really going on. I've been working a lot. Just sorry I'm not saying too much. It's pretty much the same old stuff in the past two videos. Uh, uh, I was going to show you anyway. said before this is for the new um bearded dragon that I'm gonna have. Yeah. And I just oh and I just ordered two thousand mealworms. I got some of these wax worms and I'll be good on food for a little while. And I'm getting more additions as soon as I can. And I'm getting a PlayStation four when that shit releases. Fuck yeah. <laughs> Alright guys. That's it for the video. Grand Gecko's out.